Space Explorers between the lines in three, two, one, go. Final semifinal match of regulation now underway here on Archimedes. 33 with a placement onto the cargo ship, trapping that piece of cargo within. Similar story for Blue. One more if they can get it sealed up. And it looks like they will. Just seconds into teleoperated control. Red takes the five point advantage now. As drivers regain their vision of the field, team number 33 on the far side of the field managing to patch up level one of the rocket before the 614 defense can interfere. 614 now lying in wait for the killer bee machine as they zip past to the front of the field using that multi-directional direction elevator to score in the cargo ship. Blue with the advantage here. Team number 4776, the Scott Spots from Howell High School now with a piece of cargo on the far side of the field, scoring unimpeded for the Blue Alliance in level one of the rocket. And another score from 33, despite the defense of 614, Nighthawks chase after. Successful defense on the near side of Primus now is 1720. The team from Muncie, Indiana is slowing down the 222 Tigertrons. They're back in their hab zone to collect a safe space for these robots, but now heading back into no man's land. Team 222 pushing their way towards the cargo ship. 1720 fixed gears not giving up easily. They do deliver, but it looks like one piece of cargo already in that bay, so no joy there. 55 to 53 with just under one minute left in play. Here come the killer bees for the Red Alliance. They deliver on level one of the rocket. Their teammates, Inverse Paradox, will try to do it as well. 33, beating them to it, taking it to the cargo ship themselves. Seven cargo in the cargo ship for the Blue Alliance, six for Red. As we reach our 30 second mark, it's close here, 64 to 56. Blue Alliance breaks off first, the Scott Spot head to their half platform, going up on to level three. 16 seconds left as the Killer Bees make their way towards the Alliance Station wall. Climbs coming in here in the last 10 seconds. Red Alliance takes the one point lead. Five seconds for Blue. It's three, two, one. Inverse Paradox right on the edge there. Should count for level one, just Going to Blue, 88 to 86. The Blue Alliance takes it. Unfortunately, that half climb at the very end might have been the difference maker. Blue Alliance.